So guys, for the first step, you want to find Roblox Player on your desktop, then you want to right click on it, and then click on properties, and then you want to click on compatibility, and then you want to tick disable full screen optimizations, and click on OK. For the second step, we're going to head over to search and type in percent local app data percentage sign and click on enter. Once you're on this, we're going to scroll down and then we're going to find the Roblox temporary files folder. You want to delete this. Don't worry, once you open back up Roblox again, it will restore your temporary files, so this does nothing bad. Once you do both of these steps, you want to open up Roblox and see if it's working. But if it's not working, then we're going to move on to the next method. Head over to search and then type in troubleshoot settings. Click on it. Once you're on this, you want to click on other troubleshooters and then you want to run the network and internet troubleshooter. Click on run and if it detects any problems, then it will tell you how to fix it. Then you want to head over to search and type in add remove programs. Click on it. Once you're on this, you want to scroll down and then you want to find anything that says Roblox on it. You want to click on the three dots and then click on uninstall and then you want to uninstall it. Once Roblox has been uninstalled, you want to restart your computer and then once your computer has been restarted you want to head over to search and type in microsoft store click on it and then you want to search for roblox and then install it to your computer and then open it up and then the problem should be fixed 